What's up guys? This is George from Vacuum Box Lab. Today I want to introduce you and show you a new product we simply call the box. Or in technical terms we call this vacuum oven for perch and extractions. We did some marketing research and uh, noticed there is a demand for the smaller and affordable home perch system for the honey oil. And uh, we decided to design and manufacture this uh, system for you guys. Take a look at some of the components and operation of this unit. It is very simple to use and operate. We made sure that when you purchase and receive unit from us, you don't have to look or buy anything else. All components are pre-assembled and ready to use. The basic requirements from you is simply connect few cables uh, with quick connect hoses and uh, connect couple plugs and turn power on. But you don't need to buy a heater, cooking pots or funny looking jars. All our units high-tech design, manufacture and assemble in Silicon Valley. We also strive to provide highest quality components and systems and our engineers and technicians constantly working to improve operational characteristics, looks and feel of the system. You may see from our lab bench, you know, like we're doing some, you know, like design even tonight, you know, like to minimize the size of the thermostat and everything. So don't pay attention, you know, when you see the actual unit, it's going to be absolutely nicely designed and assembled together with houses and everything. Uh, we also use nice uh, aluminum platter and uh, uh, ceramic heating elements. Uh, uh, and uh, we, achieve, we were able to achieve very small footprint of the system. When you're done, you pretty much disassemble, you know, like remove the parts, uh, store it away for the next use. Uh, and most important, the price uh, of the unit is only one third of any competitive units on market. Uh, and again, it has built-in heater in it and aluminum platter. And we're also using low voltage 12 volts high current power to heat the elements, so it's safe, very safe. Also, the you know the funny parts, you know, like we've been asked several times, uh, what if you guys, you know, need to expand your system and have more product? And it's very simple. You just buy more chambers like this one, connect to a single larger pump, and you you pretty much expand your system without disposing older units. So you pretty much grow as you go. Started from small and get bigger as you need it. Now to the operation of the units. Again, it's very simple. You pretty much have the chamber, vacuum chamber, glass vacuum chamber, the pop, pump. Again, it's going to get connected very with quick connect. Uh, you have vacuum pump, uh, vacuum air valves and vacuum valves. And you have vacuum meter over here. Uh, the simplicity of it, you plug everything into the AC power, okay, pump and the heater, okay, uh, open the unit up. It has uh, silicon conductive, thermoconductive uh, material over here to conduct uh, in vacuum temperature heating element from the aluminum to the to the product. Okay, it already comes with the system. Oh, it's nice and warm. You pretty much put your product on special paper on top of this. Close the glass. Set desired temperature and you know you're gonna have options either use Celsius for European guys or Fahrenheit for uh, for US market okay and a uh, unit actually both 110 and 220 volts uh, compatible and uh, set desired temperature close the air valve open the vacuum valve okay turn the pump on and gently apply pressure here for a few seconds for vacuum start build up in the chamber you can see from the gauge it's actually the vacuum keep going when temperature uh, gonna hit the desired settings uh, we set actually 235 uh, degree Fahrenheit or it's a 57 Celsius okay the system gonna shut itself off okay basically I'm gonna apply the power right now and you can see it the LED is on, you know, like so. This means the heater is actually uh, turned on, and the temperature gonna go up. I'm gonna shut the lights off if you want, okay? And you can actually see the temperature is going up rapidly because we're using ceramic heating elements. The temperature actually, you know, achieving really fast. You don't have to wait half an hour, 20 minutes like some other systems to boil the water. Again, the the heating plate gonna get to the temperature literally like in 20 seconds, and then when the temperature Desired temperature is gonna get achieved, you know, like it's gonna shut off and keep the temperature, desired temperature to plus minus one degree. Okay, you're gonna see it's still rising. And again, you can actually turn the valve, vacuum valve 
turn it off. Okay, shut the pump and it's gonna keep the vacuum in the chamber. And you see it's going up, okay, and it's gonna achieve desired temperature and shuts it off. And you can see it shuts off, okay, and it's bring down temperature and it's pretty much gonna keep to 57 degree Celsius or 135 Fahrenheit. And again, you can actually set the temperature, you know, like from the zero to literally 200 degree Fahrenheit. Uh, you can also set the settings and not go to over the limit of the temperature. And you can turn the pump on and off uh, several times to pretty much achieve desired uh, effect for your product. You can actually see there is a bubbles build up, you know, like some gas has been pump from the from the system from the uh, product actually and again as soon as you achieve desired product desired condition of the product what you do you shut the power off for the heater and you turn the pump off open the air valve to let the air in inside the chamber so you can actually open up and that's it it's very easy, simple as the box.